morning, y'all. Welcome to today's vlog. Uh, it's a travel vlog. Getting ready to head out to the airport. It's around 2 in the morning. I could not sleep for the life of me. I'm all congested. I'm definitely taking this with me. Um, but time to head down to the airport. Go to the Atena X conference. Get on the plane. The plane takes off at 8.30. But if I sleep here, if I fall asleep here... I am terribly afraid that I'll miss my flight and I'll have to reschedule or pay for another flight. So I'm just going to go down there. I'm going to take my stuff down to the car first, grab a monster, and then I'll see you guys once I'm at the airport. See you later. See you in a few. <laughs> So we made it to the airport. Time to get the shit out of the car. Try to do this with one hand. Suitcase. DJI Spark. I found a few good places to fly down in Florida, so I'm kind of I'm looking forward to being able to do that. And uh, I'm going to set you guys up here in a second somewhere. I don't know where I'm going to put my phone yet. I don't feel like taking my whole cat, my camera out and then doing a whole, a whole walking shot. So this may have to work for now. So I do apologize for the inconvenience. Just be right back. Now, last night when I was putting everything together, I made a whole, uh, what do you call it? spreadsheet of everything I brought with me camera wise and I just want to check everything real quick uh, 10 to 18 50 70 to 300 what I really like about this there it goes what I really love about this suitcase and this bag is they go together they're not made with, from the same company but the bag is got the strap on the back that's kind of coming together but once you do, it's useful as hell. I'm gonna throw this up here. Hopefully, if I can get it. There, there's one half. Oh no, I lost it. There we go. Put the waist right here. It's gonna want to tip over. And then tripod. I'll probably have to put the tripod in a different spot on here once I get checked and and everything. But this is my carry-on. There ain't no way in hell I'm putting this through or checking it in. Not with this much stuff and frankly there's about six thousand dollars worth of gear in here right now, so it's just be a stupid idea. Go ahead and feed that through. I'd use the water bottle holder for the bottom of this because the other one wasn't just, it wasn't quite big enough. Sorry, I'm a little shaky and the exposure is kind of crumbed down here. But you can see here I use the water bottle holder. It's quite useful. If anything, if I need to actually use that for a water bottle or anything, I can just take that off and this is good hanging. So I'm not too worried about that. Now the drone I'll just carry, but I'll see you guys a bit later. 
Uh, I'm gonna let my phone charge for a bit. I charged on the way to the airport because it was almost dead. When I got in the car, it was like 2%. Now it's about 48, I think. But I'll catch you guys later, got my keys. Yep, okay. See you later. Hey guys, what's up? It's boring. It's late. Well, actually, it's a bit early today. It's like 4 a.m. I think. People are looking at me and laughing. Just having a fun old time here at the airport. Taking some photos. Catching attention. Loving it. This place is actually huge. If you guys have never flown into Indianapolis International, it's massive. It's like on par with LAX, I think. I've only been to LAX once, but I've been to Indy uh, 15 times in my lifetime. So, <sighs> yeah, it's just a fun old time. I'm gonna try and shoot some B-roll while I'm here. I got like another hour and a half or two hours before I even need to go to TSA and get checked in. But um, I'm going to try. Kind of plan out something. Getting some cool B-roll for you guys. But I don't know how well it's going to go over. I want it to go over real well, but kind of difficult. Yeah. Just a little old travel vlog. I might make this whole vlog just like one giant video encapsulating the entire experience of Miami and then other vlogs along the lines of like Miami street photography and if I can catch any clients while I'm there for 150 bucks or 200 bucks or whatever while I'm just down there for five days maybe I could you know make some money while I'm down there too and just have it charged I've got my square card Ugh. It's in my bag. It's, it's pretty deep right now, so I'm not going to try and dig it out. But I've got my square card in there, so if people are like, I don't have cash on me. It's like, that's all right. That's okay. Visa, MasterCard, American Express. <laughs> I'm really trying to make this whole YouTube thing a career, but it's 65 subscribers, and I keep getting dislikes in some of my videos. It makes me want to ramp up my content game quality-wise and just kind of dig it down, like ramp it down for quantity wise you know so I think that's what I'm gonna do from here on out I'm gonna uh, I really don't like the way how compressed that is we back you guys up a little bit that's not much better but let me set you up here there we go that that's that's better I think what do you guys think leave in the comments below do you guys like it better sitting on top of this little charger port thing but um for now uh, I'm gonna try and shoot some B-roll. Everything I'm shooting is in in log profile, so color correcting is gonna be a bitch. But I brought my backpack as a carry-on, so I'm gonna be working on some photo editing as well as the vlog while I'm on the plane. If you guys look at this, look at this place. It's insane. Look how big this place is. This is like the main amphitheater. This place is huge. I'm really excited to go down to, to Miami, obviously. I, I booked a ticket for a grand for the conference, and plane ticket was like 160. I actually got a pretty good deal on the plane ticket. I got it way early. I bought it the same day I bought the, uh, the conference ticket. And I got it for like 160 bucks round trip to Miami to Indy. And on the, on the way back, it's going from Miami to Charlotte, Charlotte to Indy. So I think I, I stole some, some seats on that one. But. <sighs> Man, it's early. Damn, am I tired. I haven't slept. I woke up yesterday at like like a 9 a.m. I had to sell my guitar at 10. Mm. 
It's a uh, probably going to be a 21 hour day or 24 if not longer because as soon as I get to Miami I'm waiting to hear back from the reservation from Airbnb because I canceled my hotel because I found an Airbnb for $190 cheaper and it's a 30 minute drive so it's not too bad but I'm waiting to hear back from those people because when I get down there I'm going to want to go straight to the Airbnb and probably pass out for a couple hours and then if they don't answer by the time I get down there I'm just like fucked because I'll be carrying around a suitcase and a rental car I'm not I haven't even skipped the idea of sleeping in the rental car all weekend but that is not fun plus it's Miami <laughs> you know what goes down in Miami I'll catch you guys a little bit later see ya guys Tristan here this is day two of the 10x conference I got here at 12 I slept an absolute ton last night because I didn't have any sleep for 37 hours yesterday so I wanted to be sure I'm well rested and then I got in around 12 just got out with lunch but if you haven't been to this yet you guys need to come on out this is incredible uh, if you want to talk to somebody about it hit up the uh, uh, Dietz, Dietz on my uh, Instagram I tagged him in my story, so if you guys want to check it out, my Instagram is at I am Tristan Gibson. I'll see you guys later.
Micro Works Foundation. Everybody stand up and give a 10x welcome to my man, Mr. Mike. What's going on guys? I'm all fucking 10 x out. Um, the conference just finished up for the weekend. Can't wait to come back next year. I'm gonna try and bring a special someone with me next year. And I'm definitely gonna be blowing the fuck out of my business, blowing it up this year. My goal for money in business this year is to hit the 500, or uh, the $500,000 mark. Now, that's just like my, my actual personal goal. My, my real goal in the next five years to take it to about five million. And uh, it's gonna take a lot of work. I'm gonna have to hire some people in the future, probably pretty soon. Oh yeah, I got all these bracelets. Like uh, whatever it takes, I can't even read that one. Keep pushing, hustle, muscle or something. 10X, success is my duty, be positive. We got another one in my bag. It says, don't be a little bitch. And I like that one a lot because I got three of them. I got a couple more of some of these other ones and just to give them out to people who start to work with me and try to introduce them to Grant and everything. So I've also got the 10X rule, which is a book I've read quite a few times. I'm gonna give it to one guy that's been working with me on photography. He's a client, he's a chiropractor. And I also, I'm gonna refer him to Grant's stuff and tell him that I gave his number to a one of the sales guys here. May not like me too much for it at first because nobody likes to be sold on shit they don't think they need. But then when he starts to get into the program, tell him, I'll tell him like, if you just wanna get the indi individual plan at this point, I will pay for it myself. You need to be on this. You need to dive into this. You need to learn everything that you can for your practice so you can take your business from X amount to an X amount. And there are some really cool stories, guys, about all this. And I'm gonna tell him later in this vlog, this is just a huge long vlog. All weekend, I haven't had time to go out and film and shoot photos really all too much. It's hot as shit, guys. Holy crap. Um, so tonight, since it's only 3, 3 o'clock right now, or 4, um, I will be going out and shooting some footage of Miami and around town. I'm going to find some cool spots. I'm going to try and fly my drone on the beach without getting arrested or in trouble. But um, I'm really looking forward to going out and shooting some photography. It's hot today. It's like almost 80 degrees right now. I can't wait to go home. Oh man, I'm looking really a whole lot to go home and it'd be like 40, 50 degrees. I don't want to go back. I don't want to go home, but I have to, <laughs> I gotta go home. So I take off tomorrow around 10 o'clock. I land in the afternoon and from there, I'm just gonna start hitting restaurants up and be like, let me shoot photography for you. Let me shoot photography for you. Make me, give me some money, give me some money, give me some money. And uh, just get that, get that hustle back and go and then Tuesday. I'm setting my whole plan up, so as soon as I get home, I don't have my 10 external here now with me, I forgot it. But as soon as I get home, I'm gonna start getting up at 4 35 o'clock, going to the gym, coming back, shit, shower, shave, and have breakfast, and then right after breakfast, I'm gonna start getting into Cardo and you and just watch, start watching segments and practicing my sales pitch and everything like that. And um, I am red as hell, y'all, holy crap. Get that AC going. I'm gonna take off here for a little bit. Enjoy the vlog. What's up guys? I'm out in the ocean right now. <laughs> this is so much fun. I have my iPhone with me obviously, uh, not my, my DSLR, but the iPhone X, uh, XS is water resistant. So I might even drop it in and just film underneath the water to get some cool shots. It's like so. This is pretty, this is pretty nice. The water's a little brisk. I'm just gonna keep going out for a minute until my feet don't touch. I don't like the ocean very much. It actually terrifies me quite a bit because of everything that's in it. Like at the depth I'm at now, you can easily fit a bull shark or a tiger shark. Those aren't native in this, this uh, part of the world. Oh, here comes a big one. But, I'm just trying to push my limits. Can't be afraid to go out. Oh, it's getting close there. Okay. 
<laughs> Hold on a second.